I love asparagus. And right now it's showing up in all the grocery stores. It's ready to pick up, bring home, and if you're not going to eat it right away, keep it in the refrigerator in a little bit of water. Typically when you pick it up at the grocery store, it's standing in water. So I like to bring it home and just trim a little bit off the ends, put it in a little bit of water. Now this I got two days ago and it's still really nice and firm and it's really fresh. So it's delicious raw, but it's even better when it's roasted. It has an amazing flavor, and the only thing that can make it better is when it marries with lemon. Lemon and asparagus go together a little bit like strawberries and rhubarb. It's delicious, and it's one of those seasonal flavors you look forward to. Tonight, I'm going to show you how you can roast asparagus and give it that lemony flavor by just adding some lemon slices. So when you're ready to start cooking or roasting your asparagus, you'll notice that it has a little bit of a woody, tough end to it. And it's one of nature's little miracles, I guess you could call it. When you hold the asparagus at the end and give it a little snap, it breaks in just the right spot to get rid of that woody end. So do that to asparagus. And if you want to serve four people, you'll probably need about 12 ounces of asparagus spears trimmed. And then I just laid them on a baking sheet. I'm going to drizzle it with a little bit of olive oil, maybe about a tablespoon. And I'm just going to roll these around so that they're coated with the olive oil. Then season it with a little bit of salt and a little bit of ground pepper. And then for the lemony flavor, all you need to do is slice a lemon really nice and thin and lay it right over those asparagus spears and be generous with the lemon. Once you've got your lemon slices over the asparagus, it's ready to go into the oven 400 degrees for about 20 minutes. But watch it really close because depending on the thickness of your asparagus spears, that will determine how long it needs to be roasting in the oven. And when you bring your asparagus out of the oven, you can see that it's just perfectly tender. So you've got a side dish that's full of vitamin C and K and folate, great antioxidant and lots of anti-inflammatory properties. So it's so good for you and so delicious. I'm Sue Doden sharing Good Food for Good Life 365.